Hey, welcome to the show. Today in the show, I have some challenging problems that we're gonna use order of operation. But before we start, I wanna ask you a question. What did the shark say when he ate the clownfish? That tastes a little funny, doesn't it? <laughs> All right, let's get started here. And also, I wanna uh, have a couple shout outs right here. Um, I wanna shout out for Rama in India and also Maria over there in Somali. And we also have Omar in Syria and Nico in Jamaica. Hey, I'd love to uh, do a little shout out for yourself. Um, always just put your name in the comment. Maybe tell me a little bit about yourself. Maybe your favorite pizza or what grade you are or if, even if you need some help in math. So let's get started here. Remember when we do order of operation, we do whatever's inside the parentheses first, then the exponent, then multiplication and division from left to right, and addition and subtraction from left to right. So, all right, let's get started. Do you see any parentheses? <laughs> I do, right over here, two times six. So let's go ahead and rewrite this problem here. So we're gonna go ahead and do our parentheses here. So that'd be 18 divided by two, minus seven plus whatever's inside the parentheses. That is two times six, which is 12, yeah. So that is 12. And I'm gonna keep those parentheses right around on that 12 and put the exponent there. So let's go ahead and do the problem here. Again, we're gonna do the exponent. And you know, when you start to do this and you get more practice, you know you'll be able to skip around a little bit. You know, you'll be able to do 18 divided by two. So I'm just gonna keep it just simple for today. So we're gonna do 18 divided by two minus seven plus 12 times 12, that's the exponent. 12 to the second power is 12 times 12, which is 144. All right, make sure you practice that multiplication. All right, let's keep on moving. All right, we have 18 divided by two. What times two equals 18? Nine. So we have nine minus seven plus 144. Now, addition and subtraction, we just from left to right, all right. So nine minus seven, yeah, two, dos. We have two right here, plus 144. 144 plus two, 145, 146 is the answer, 146. Now, just like yourself, always make sure you kind of look through the problem, make sure you did it right. I think it looks good. Hey, you ready to do another challenging problem? Yeah, let's do it, yeah. All right, welcome back. Okay, we're always trying to have fun on this show here. Um, we need to do what's inside parentheses first, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and rewrite this. So we have three times five to the second power divided by 25 plus, and let's go work what's inside these parentheses. All right, now, the first reaction when you see that is like, yeah, let's do 16 minus three. No, 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 no. Remember, order of operation. We need to do the exponent right now, okay? We need to do that first. So we go ahead and do 16 minus three to the second power. Three times three, nine, nueve. All right, so we put nine right there. Now we do it all over again. I better make this more of a parenthesis. It kind of looks like a a bent one, but uh, okay, <laughs> let's, let's begin here. Um, what do we have to do? Let's go ahead and finish our parentheses. So I'm gonna rewrite this. Now, like I said, when you, you become more, you know, used to doing things, you, can, you might be able to skip around a little bit, you know, do this chunk right here and that, but taking it step by step. So three times five to the second power divided by 25 plus Go ahead and do that. 16 minus nine, what is it? Seven sent from heaven, yes. All right, keep on going, keep on moving, keep on trucking, all right here. Let me see, what should we do here? Uh, let's do, remember, or order of operation. Are there any parentheses? Nope. Exponents, yep, <laughs> right there. Just remember, step by step, take it easy, take it easy, cheesy. Three times five to the second power, five to the second power, five times five, 25. All right, so we'll put 25 right there and then just rewrite the rest of the problem. 
divided by 25 plus 7. See how it is? Just taking a smooth action right here. What do we do next? But we got multiplication, we got division and addition. Let's just from left to right do our addition and our, uh, not our addition, our <laughs> multiplication and our division. Okay, um, 3 times 25, that's like quarters, like 25 plus 25 is 50, and another 25 is 75. So 3 times 25 is 75, divided by 25 plus 7. All right, 75 divided by 25. How many times will we put 25 into 75? Three times. Uno, dos, tres. Yeah. So 75 divided by 25 is 3 plus 7. 3 plus 7. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> with, with all this work right here, 3 plus 7, 10. You got it. You got it. 10, 10 it is. Hey, you guys have been doing a great job. Give yourself a little pat on the back there. Amazing. This is fun. This is like a puzzle. Make it fun. Hey, also, I got a lot of other videos on my channel. Check them out. I'd love to hear a comment from you. Like I said, uh, put a comment down below. Maybe your name, favorite cookie, favorite pizza, maybe what school you're going to, where, you're, where you live. Maybe there's a problem you need help, or you just want to just say howdy or, or hello or anything. I'd love to hear. I, I read all the comments. Also, hit that likey button, wherever it is, that subscribe button. And like always, have a fun day. Adios.